During this video segment, I will show you the lesson plan review or access in Curriculum Track, as well as what a curriculum admin will be able to review related to the lessons area. So currently I'm logged in as a Curriculum Track admin. So I have access to all my admin tools. As you well know, in Curriculum Track, there's three levels of permissions. There's Curriculum Viewers, there's curriculum editors and curriculum admins. Curriculum admins have full access to all the setup um, and everything basically of curriculum tracks. So you want to limit how many people have that access. Any of your curriculum admin folks will be able to go to the lessons and they'll have access to these extra admin tools. So as a curriculum admin, curriculum track admin, I'll have the ability to view lessons uh, for all the teachers. So these are all the teachers in this school. So I can pull up any of these teachers and I can pull up her classes and I can see a full listing of all of her lessons. And if I want to click on any of those, I can click on the PDF print. Um, so if I want to print it or just view it, I can view it as well. So let's close that. So again, as a curriculum track admin, you have the ability to access all those lessons. You also have the ability to view the weekly planners of any teacher within your school system. So here I can pull up any teacher one at a time and I can see what lessons they're all teaching. And incidentally, this is just showing me um, the lesson titles, but if I want to see more details without having to click on those, I can click on that link on the bottom and say, I would also like to see lesson attachments, um, which unit it's attached to and so forth. And so now notice it has those details as well. And uh, this is specific to the user. So I'm logged in as Dan Barons right now. If I do this, it won't affect this teacher, Luke. Um, he can choose for himself what he sees. So again, as a curriculum track admin, I have access to the ability to see all the weekly planners. And notice I can move forward a week, or I could go back a week. I can go to the week of um, you know, September 3 if I wanted to, and so forth. So it allows me to see what's being taught by the teachers. The other thing I can do as an admin is I can attach teachers to reviewers. The lesson plan reviewer is someone that should have the ability to see the lesson plans for a group of teachers, but you don't necessarily want to make them a full-fledged curriculum track admin. Maybe they're a building principal um, in just uh, the middle school. And you really don't want them to be a curriculum track admin because then they could delete courses. Um, the, you know, they can change your utilities. They could go into the benchmarks and potentially delete some and so forth. Um, so you want to kind of limit their access, but you want it so that they can review the teachers in the middle school, um, see their lesson plans. So here I set up uh, a reviewer. Let me scroll down just a bit here so it doesn't cut off. Uh, called Mike Vanderberg. So if I choose Mike Vanderberg, um, I know that he is not an admin in the software, but I would like him to be able to see these students. And to add more students, you can double click, or you can click on the first and last and just hold your control key down to select them. Uh, so these are the teachers uh, in the middle school that Mike should be able to see and review. So let's click Save. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to log in as Mike instead. So you can see what that looks like. So let me find uh, Mike Vanderberg here. Um, in fact, notice he is not an editor. So if I log in as Mike, notice the admin tools are completely gone for him. Um, but what he can do is he can go to Lessons and he can view the progress report, but notice those other admin tools are not available to him. Um, so as a viewer, they can see the progress report, but then the other thing they can do is if they go to the weekly planner, notice there is a drop down here with the teachers that are attached to him. You can't see all the teachers. This is not all the teachers in the school, but it's just the teachers that are attached to him. 
And again, he can specify if he wants to see more fields. So a curriculum viewer will only be able to see the teachers attached to him or her and will do that from within the weekly planner. The other thing that a curriculum track view, uh, reviewer can do is, or I should say a lesson plan reviewer, sorry, is um, view the weekly planner for the teachers attached to him or her and can see the lesson plan progress report. I think when we logged in as Dan, he was not able to see that. And that's because even though he was a full-fledged admin, in his uh, permissions, he was not marked as a lesson plan reviewer. So if we want to change that, let's go ahead and go back into Dan's account one last time here. And so we'll log in as Dan. Notice he has the admin tools. But if we go to Dan's account, let's do a search for Dan's account. And we'll edit that. Notice that he is a full-fledged admin, but he's not a lesson plan reviewer. By clicking on that lesson plan reviewer, now notice that he also has access to the lesson plan progress report, um, whereas he didn't have it before. And so he can see the progress of lesson plans for any of those teachers. Um, now, the other thing that he can do as a lesson plan reviewer is he can go to the weekly planner and he could see the teachers attached to him. Currently, there are no teachers attached to him. But if I go to attach um, teachers to reviewers, I can now pull up Dan and I could do that. I'm not sure that that's necessary because as a curriculum admin, he's able to see actually the lesson plans, the weekly planners for all the teachers. Although, you know, that may be a pain for him to look through all those. So you still, as a curriculum track reviewer, uh, lesson plan reviewer could attach him just to those fields. This now concludes, concludes this video segment on being a curriculum track admin and how that relates to lesson plans and what a curriculum, uh, a lesson plan reviewer has access to.